I believe that Moorhead can take you places you never dreamed of going. I grew up in Avondale in the inner city. I was born in Maysville, Kentucky. But if you told me that that little guy from Avondale could go on to become part of the Bengals broadcast team and be part of conversations at presidential libraries and museums and represent high profile athletes like Eric Davis and Deion Sanders, like, I don't know that I could have dreamed that. But Moorhead helped make that happen because the exposure I got at Moorhead in the communications department, the relationships I built. I mean, Phil Sims and I in the same business and when he would come to Cincinnati, we'd get together. You're thinking about two guys, number one draft pick for the New York Giants. You know, here's a guy doing football every Sunday on TV. I'm doing football every Sunday on radio and Moorhead was a conduit for that. So when I think about Moorhead and enriching my career, man, I, I'm just telling you, it's it's been a vital part of it. I can look back and clearly say that that experience and that time there and those hands-on types of activities and the teachers and you know everything else contributed to my success. Well, I had worked in radio um, for WDBZ and we had a sports talk show, which uh, I helped launch that sports talk platform. And then a gentleman named Vince Cicero, who's with FC Cincinnati now, was with the Bengals and he called and said, hey, would you like to do some shows? Yes. <laughs> and so we had the Bengals game plan show and then the Bengals pep rally Friday. And the pep rally show was always on location pre-pandemic. And you go out three hours of engaging with fans and they would always provide us with one of the players. And so whenever Dan Horde was doing UC basketball, I would fill in. And so I started getting more opportunities. And about four years ago, they called and said, hey, we're gonna make some changes. Uh, would you be interested in doing the you know, pre, post, halftime? And I said, let me think about it, yes. Uh, <laughs> and, and so from there, this is where it's all evolved to. So just to, to be part of this team right now, at this moment with this success, after we've all gone through the lean years, I think that's why everyone is so excited about it. Cincinnati is heading to the Super Bowl. Wow, Joe Burrow, no way.